What is Beyblade? So you may have heard of this from your kids, seen it on the shelves at store, or caught a little bit of the anime and thought to yourself, this is just a toy for kids, right? Well, yes and no. Beyblade is a spinning top battling game, and some might even say sport. Each player customizes their own Beyblade by putting together available parts to create themselves a combination, and then send these bays spinning into the arena to battle it out. The last Beyblade still spinning is the victor. You can play with these how they come out of the box, but there's actually a lot of thought and complication that can come into building a combination once you actually understand the physics behind it. Beyblade is actually a science game, and understanding the physics that goes behind spinning momentum objects interacting with each other can actually vastly increase your chances of success in this game. That's kind of where we draw the line, where you can do a lot of deep, complicated analysis, and there can be a lot of competitive variety. It starts to evolve from just a toy. We're now in the fourth generation of Beyblade, called Beyblade X. This is releasing globally in June 2024, and released locally in Japan in 2023. Each generation of Beyblade has been wildly different from the others, and the Beyblades now might not represent the Beyblades that you remembered if you played years ago. With Beyblade X as the current generation, we're going to focus talking about that one, and we're not really going to be touching too much on the previous generations. So Beyblades come with three different parts. The top layer is the blade. The blade is the main contact point between the blades. This is going to give you the general shape of your Beyblade, as well as give you your unique avatar and style. The middle layer is referred to as the Ratchet. It controls changes in height and controlling the center of gravity of your bay, as well as handles slight changes in the balance of it with the different shapes. The tip is the base of the Beyblade and interacts with the stadium itself. It's going to decide how your Beyblade moves and is the largest contributing factor to spin duration. These tips have a geared section around the outside, and the stadium has this gear track. If the gears interact with the gear track, your bay is going to go spinning at an extreme speed for increased damage and more fun battles. Combining these three parts together is going to give you your Beyblade. And once you have it ready, how exactly do you win? A Beyblade match consists of multiple battles until one blader has received an appropriate score, usually four or seven points in Beyblade X. There are four victory conditions for a battle, and each of these conditions is going to have a different set of points. The survival finish, or spin-out finish, is when your Beyblade is still spinning, and the other Beyblade has stopped and fallen over. This is worth one point. For two points, we've got the burst victory, where the enemy Beyblade comes apart, with the tip removing from the ratchet and the blade. We also have the over finish, or knockout finish, where a Beyblade is sent into one of the side pockets and gets stuck, unable to re-enter the stadium. The final victory condition is new to Beyblade X, and it's called an extreme finish. There's a large opening on one side of the stadium, and if a Beyblade gets knocked out of that opening and out of the stadium, they are extremed for a whopping three victory points. Once your battle is done, you flip your stadium to the opposite side and go at it again. Once one player has your maximum matches, you've achieved victory, and then build a new combo and battle again. We at Sazaza Games believe that Beyblade is a great hobby for people of any age. It fosters a very creative mindset in its players. It teaches about physics and momentum, and it can give you a pretty great option for a gift for a kid or a loved one. This hobby can be a great family activity, but there's also a large tournament scene worldwide. There's a great social aspect to Beyblade to be able to connect with people that are like-minded. The World Beyblade Organization is a massive resource for players to be able to go to a forum and chat about this hobby. Being local tournament organizers, we've watched kids and adults develop over the years as they've mastered their skills in this fun game. You can sign up and compete against other players in your area, testing your combos against them for ultimate glory. Our channel focuses a lot on that tournament scene, so if you want to learn more about that, don't forget to smash that like button, hit subscribe, and turn on those notifications. If you've gotten into Beyblade, and you want to learn tips and tricks for launching your Beyblade, you can find our guide for that right here. I'm Zesty Fresh and Sazaza Games, and we'll catch you guys next time. What even is Beyblade? What's Beyblade? Beyblade? What even is that? You want some Beyblade? Hey kids, you want to get into some Beyblade?